tragedy. It's something that didn't have to happen. And Miss Taylor's family, it was just, she didn't need to die that night. Former officer Brett Hankison faces wanton endangerment charges for shooting into a neighboring apartment the night Brianna Taylor died. <laughs> he claims he saw muzzle flashes and what appeared to be someone holding a gun. I knew Sergeant Mattingly was down and I knew, I knew they were trying to get to him. And it appeared to me that they were being executed with this rifle. So what did you do? I returned fire through, excuse me, through the sliding glass door. Hankison said he wasn't briefed on the layout of the complex and didn't know there was an adjacent apartment. He said he ran to the sidewalk where he saw the flashing lights through a glass door and curtained bedroom windows. So he fired. Why did you do what you did? To protect myself and more importantly and first primary function at that time when I returned fire was to protect the fellow detectives that were that were stuck in that stuck in that breezeway. Were you concerned that if you shot through the sliding door, you might hit one of your fellow officers? Absolutely not. Prosecutors doubling down on whether Hankison knew he went against policy by heading directly to the hospital. Is it your testimony that you had no knowledge or did not know the regulations of public integrity, the protocols of the public integrity unit? No, none of our cases, to my recollection, involved the PIU unit as in, as in a shooting investigatory uh, way. None of our merit board cases were for that.